For the first time ever, skin cells have been used to create human eggs that can be fertilized. It's part of a groundbreaking study that could open new doors for women with fertility problems and same-sex couples. News Nation's Max Tavares spoke with one of the lead researchers on what their team learned. Max, good morning. This is exciting news. Yeah, it certainly is. It means that technically two men could now make a baby with both their genetic makeup without the need for a woman's DNA. Researchers at Oregon Health and Science University created functional human embryos by replacing DNA from an egg with genetic material from a person's skin, skin cell instead. The team fertilized this newly created egg with sperm, which could later be transferred into a womb using IVF. The implications are wide-reaching here, giving the opportunity for anyone to now have children, even if they don't have their own eggs. Not just for men, but for women who struggle to conceive, whether that's due to age, infertility, or medical treatment. And that's because this new process called mitomiosis can theoretically provide an unlimited supply of fresh eggs to those who need them, Nick. Max, uh, so many questions here, but when could we start seeing this method used to help people get pregnant who have, who have no other option? Yeah, that's still at least a decade away, and that's because the research published in the Scientific Nature Journal, or the Scientific Journal called Nature, is a proof of concept study. That means it's in the very early stages with many hurdles still needing to be overcome. The team created 82 functional eggs, which were then fertilized in a lab. However, only 9% of those successfully developed embryos, and all of them had abnormalities in the chromosomes. Afterwards, none were implanted, but rather destroyed. The lead researcher telling me there's still a lot of work that needs to be done here. That's very exciting to many LGBTQ people. Um, I would say don't hold your breath. I mean, if you're if you're ready to start a family, you probably want to do it, you know, now. But I do think it will be possible in in the future. And even if the success rate increased, other scientists questioned the potential ethical and regulatory issues this technique could pose if it was actually used to create babies. Thank you for watching. Subscribe below and download our News Nation app right now on your phone, and you will get fact based, unbiased news for all Americans.